The show is Silent Library. And the title of this one is Six Jersey Boys. I'm a Jersey boy as well. Take on Hopping Blow, Old Master, and Bald Spit. Couldn't tell you what that's going to mean. We're going to have to find out ourselves here. I'm Zero Kazama. Zero Kazama. This is not a game show. This is Silent Library. Also, anybody saw the KNJ video we did for this? We obviously took it from that. Meet the players. He definitely looks like a Matt. Matt. A nice V-neck there. Brendan. Hasbrock Heights? Never heard of that in my life. Anybody heard of Hasbrock? Brock? Has... Brock? I've never heard of that before. Yvonne. Yvonne. Looks like Joe Sanagato, but different. That's like, uh... That's no Sanagato. Mark? Oh, Mark. Okay, no... Mike. This is like the Jersey Shore, but like the cast that didn't get picked. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> this is like the guys that tried out for Jersey Shore and they're like, um, you want to do Silent Library, maybe? A little bit? Maybe something like that? Like and Vinny. Oh, wait, Vinny. I just caught, I think I just spawned Vinny. Hold on. Six for wait a second. Maybe Fred. my joke was accurate here. Yeah, they couldn't get the they could this is this is backup Vinny. Six friends, one team, playing for thousands of dollars in cash. Get all that money. The players draw cards, and the one who gets the skull and crossbones must endure an unusual punishment. If he completes the challenge, the team wins money. But if he fails, or if his teammates make too much noise, they get shot. I'm just kidding. They kiss it goodbye. Round one. Each challenge is worth $300. The most important rule, silence. Begin. All right, here we go. <laughs> it's Matt. Nope, it's not Matt. It's not M Mark. No, it's Tony. I forget. There's too many damn names. Okay, here we go. That the looks like must bounce on an inflating jumping ball. What's with the two? What? What's with those little? Uh, are they handles? Kind of look like udders. Until it explodes. Okay. Okay. Oh, they're pumping it up with air. I see. Damn. Damn. Got some, hold on, he got some legit air on that first bounce. I, my, watch this. He about to fly away like it was one of those Chinese spy balloons. Oh, the popping noise is going to scare me. Oh, no. What a, when you ever have somebody blow up a balloon next to your ear and they do it when they're and they're about to pop it and it's getting cute it's like the one of the worst feelings that and when somebody does this to me with a rubber band instant people be like oh you flinched oh, yeah yeah cuz you cuz you're about to shoot a rubber band in my eye yeah no shit i flinched i hate when people say that or be like oh, i got gotcha. you yeah cuz you just popped the balloon in my ear and i thought it was a gunshot terrible feeling don't do that oh no Oh my god! Oh my god! Holy shit! <laughs> Yo, that was no joke. Look at the the movement on his balls. Dude, he is he is still about a foot and a half, two feet in the air. Okay. Scares everybody down below. Chris Cross, thank you for the two months. Appreciate that very, very much. On his what? Yeah, the goggles helped. God, that was a that was intense. They did pass it though. Oh my god. Oh, that was pretty funny. They passed. 
Hundred percent. You survived. Yeah, good job there. And succeeded. Mark gives the guys their first win of the day. Appreciate They're on you, the Chris. Board with three hundred dollars to share. All right, three hundred bucks. That'll get you about one week of food from California. You go to what? You go to Irwan or Yerwan? I'm too broke to afford that place. You guys know what I'm talking about Yerwan. They got like twenty-two dollar smoothies. That lasts you about fifteen minutes there. People come in like, oh, they got great water. I'm like, well, yeah, it's it's glass bottled. Yeah, well, it's also thirteen dollars for a bottle of water. You know what I'm drinking? Goods and Gather, Target purified drinking water because it is fifteen cents a bottle when you do the math, and that's how you save money. Irwan, yeah, well, whatever, whatever it is, not for me. All right, here we go. Let's see if Vinny or Winnie gets it. Oh, it's Mark. I'm just going to call everybody Mark. Waterless meal. And make him eat some crackers. Let's see. The contestant has 40 seconds to eat a fully dehydrated meal, including chicken soup. Wow, that is impossible. That is impossible to finish this. Chicken soup powder, beef stro stroganoff powder, stroganoff, mashed potato powder, mashed potatoes and asparagus. And as ain't impo it's impossible. Yeah, are they trying to kill him? <laughs> There's no way. Ain't no way you could even finish one of these in 40 maybe 40 minutes. Yes. Ain't no shot. That's so much. Zero percent chance. Z d imp impossible. He's going to be bursting. Pause. Come on. Lock in. Oh, God. This is how, the, this is how Devante eats a normal chicken tender. You ever see that man eat anything? He gags. Man, that's, a, that's a Devante sip, too. Oh, he took a little sip without telling. There. It's like he's eating a bunch of Parmesan. Oh my god, or just sand from the beach. Give him credit for trying. The cinnamon challenge? That almost killed me back in the day. Can we talk about that? Anyone else here almost die from the cinnamon challenge when they were younger? I took a big spoonful once and went, Oop! and everyone was laughing, and I was like, and everyone was like laughing, like, ha ha, yes, yes, yes. And I was, I, I was trying to tell everyone that I was choking and they were all laughing and then i had to run to the sink and just shoot water down my mouth basically like from the from the hard part of the faucet never doing that again and then the cinnamon got all clumpy it was a very bad thing i think the cinnamon challenge could have been should have been illegal not gonna lie i feel bad for my boy here his power is exploding out of his mouth they set him up for failure. Not even close. How do you ex who would who do they expect these are they, do they think they're superhuman? Not even close. Bro, I'd like to see you go try it. Yeah, Glozell, shout out to Glozell. You lose. Yvonne lost his appetite. Yvonne deserves so hey, justice for Yvonne. Now, he did his Your best there. Remains at 300 bucks. Yvonne deserves a little more credit there. It's going to be Mark this time. Or is it Matt? Well, we'll see. Oh, boy. The contestant must receive punishment from a karate master with poor vision. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, boy. Here we go. He's going to punch him right in, the, right in the balls. I feel it. That would be so... Oh, no. Oh, God. This is so intimidating. He's letting the dogs out, too? Okay, come on.
Bro, how is this legal? How is that legal what he just did? Oh my god. Oh my god. Yo. I would be that's a lawsuit, Mr. Miyagi. I get that's a what in the hell? Look at this. You want to talk about direct contact like it's Mortal Kombat here. Oh my god. Yo, dad, that's, that's wild. Poor Mark can't have kids no more. My, how do you, how do you? <laughs> I'm pressing charges. <laughs> Pam don't like it, but. Bro, that. He just straight up kicked him. In the... <laughs> Ain't no way. You were brave. But your friends were too loud. If 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 they don't give him the money, I'm I would throw every book at his head. You fail. I'm throwing all the encyclopedias at my boy's head right here. If I'm getting kicked in the nuts and I don't even get the money from it because of my friends, they're all getting books to the head. Dictionaries, encyclopedias, atlases, Harry's house, I'm sure he's got a book. Whatever you want, I'm throwing it. That's unbelievable. Matt's karate lesson ends round one with a loss. The guys Poor are Matt, off to a bro, rough that's... start. They weren't even that loud. <laughs> All things considered, they were not loud. Justice. You fail. Matt's oh, they have to sign waivers for sure. One with a loss. I would have The guys are off to a rough start with oh only $300 so far. Round two. The challenges are worth $400. Jesus, that was Not round remember. one? Silence. Continue. Silence. Silence. It's going to be Mark. I'm just going to say it until Mark gets it. <laughs> it's Mark. Now, see... I don't even know if I want to know what bald spit could mean. I don't even know if I want to find out. But we're going to find out together. Okay, the well. The contestant must be shot with a pair of giant spitballs. What? <laughs> what? Oh, hell no. Hold on. How was this show legal back? I feel like this is illegal. What in the world? Okay, well, that's not what I was expecting. That is, first of all, that is humongous. That looks like pizza dough, number one. They got my man in his undies, his underoos. What is that? Was that a war cannon? What? Where are they getting the budget for this show must have been crazy. Where are they getting legit catapults? I look at this. Look at that. That's got to be a military grade weapon. This poor man, bro. How is this? How is this legal? Maybe it won't shoot that hard. I would have to put on a military uniform and at least a, a, a military grade helmet. Okay, that was okay. Now that came out soft, but it did hit him right in the balls. I thought that was going to hit him at 100 miles an hour. You see the, the you got some flight here. Now somehow in how the hell did it do it? It hits him right in. The, <laughs> that is just insane aim. Right in the balls. Okay, you know what? That probably felt terrible. That's a very heavy... That's... If anything harder would have killed him. Literally bald spit. Okay. Well, he's got to go again? Looks like it's about five pounds of...
That is disgusting. It looks like a wet newspaper or some shit. That is disgusting. Good for him. He, he survived it. God bless him. That's quite literally mortifying to look at. I hope he stops doing that. Stop rubbing his... Okay. You have emerged victorious. Brendan nice. gets the team back on track. Good job, they Brendan. $400 to their total, which now stands at Yeah, I think it might have been paper mache. That was bizarre looking. Who thinks of these? This one's gonna be Mark, I feel it. This it's finally gonna be Mark. Everything else was a joke. Okay, see, it's Mark. No, it's Vinny. I remember Vinny. Death leg! Mark has to get his leg cut off by a chainsaw! Alright, Vinny, lock in. Okay, what? First of all, what? Contestant must endure dead legs from motorized fists for- What? Bro, there, this show is absolutely- The fair- Okay, let me, let me, let me like take a break here to really think about what's going on. Who thought of this? Who is an engineer? There are two mechanical fists on the side of this man. And they are just going to punch his... Somebody's got to be on LSD when they're thinking of these. <laughs> it's not even weed. It's, it's got to be more powerful drugs than that. He's like, listen, bro. Okay, you're sitting on like a horse thing. And then you got fists, but they're mechanical. And they're just like punching his leg. And someone's like, let's do it. That's unbelievable. For 20 seconds. Dead legs are the worst. Let's see if this is hard or not. Let's find out. This man is getting fisted on television. Hey, look at Harold. <laughs> look at Harold. <laughs> I've never seen something that preposterous in my life. Only watch that on Pornhub. Legs are jiggling. This is this is embarrassing for him. He's literally getting double fisted. <laughs> oh God, I did what the. Your pain brings reward. He should have said, your pain, your gain. Mark kicks another 400... Oh, it was Mark! I got it right for once. ...bucks into the pot. The winnings climb to 1,100. Okay, good job, Mark. I was right, I didn't even know it. It's gonna be Mark. Oh, poor, uh, poor Ivan again, bro. Okay, I gotta, you know, I gotta spike suck. Oh boy, I don't even want to know. I don't even want to know what this one is. Spike suck. <laughs> I don't even want to know. We're gonna find out, but can't imagine it's gonna be anything good. <laughs> Ivan is happy about it though. Let's see. The contestant has 45 seconds to lick all the sour cream out of a stranger's spiked hair. Bro. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. I'm going to look I'm going to show the dogs for a minute. I need to I need to pause. I need to look at the dogs. I need to look at the dogs. I need it. I need a pet break. I'm going to pet the dogs. I can't chat. I can't do it. I can't do it. Got Freddie Mercury here. And Jake Weber combined. What is about... To, he's got a... Oh, boy. Okay. We can do this. Let's lock in. Let's lock in. It's the worst by far. Oh, my God. 
look, I don't even I don't, I like sour cream with certain things, but but what? <laughs> Freddie Weber. Jake Mercury. Oh. There's no way. There's no way. There's no way. I would I would I would there's no way. I would t call MTV and tell them I'm going to sue them if they air it. No. It was how is is this was this show banned on television? How is this legal? Uh-uh. No. Talk about getting a hair in your food. Stop it! Ivan, stop it! Stop it right now! You stop it right now, Ivan. Ivan! Imagine they pranked him and it was glue. It was Elmer's glue instead. Ivan, stop it! No. No. He's a warrior! <laughs> How's he doing it? How do you how do you live a normal life after this? How do you ex how do you live life after this? How What can we do? We need to Okay, you know what? We need to meditate. Try it again here, chat. Oh, crap. I accidentally posted a short that's too long. So now it's a video. Shit. Let me delete it. Frick. I always do this sometimes. Shorts have to be under a minute. Good, good job catching that one by me, though. Okay. There we go. Private. Okay. Now we're going to meditate, chat. We're going to take 10 seconds out of our day here. We are going to meditate, okay? Because what we just witnessed is not okay. Okay, here we go. How do people do this with their hands? Let's take a look at what we got here. Very nice. That's New Jersey. And this is downtown Philadelphia, center city. Beautiful. I love my city. All right, chat. Well, I'm calm now. Okay, I'm not calm anymore. Is he a turtle? What is he doing? This man deserves every ounce of money they have on him. If they say he failed, I'm spitting that sour cream in that dude's face if I was him. You tasted victory. Good. Yvonne that man deserves that man deserves ten thousand dollars. Two on a sweet note. After three straight wins, the total is up to fifteen hundred dollars. God, man. Round three. Each challenge is now worth double. Eight hundred dollars. But listen closely. Silence. Back to the game. Silence! God, that was the that was absolutely ludicrous. Luda. <sighs> it's Mark again. I can actually say it again. They all kind of look similar.
Here we, man, what is this show's obsession with balls, chat? Ski balls? We already know where this is going to go. Somebody is going to, he's going to have his legs spread open. There's going to be a target on his body. Some kid's going to come in with ski balls and just launch them. And here we go. <laughs> Okay, the close enough. Must allow his oh, I was very accurate on this. There's literally a target. Teammates to throw ski balls at his crotch. I think MTV has a fetish with people not having children. Maybe they want to control the population. They're like, you know what we can do? Let's get rid of all these guys' uh, chances of uh, reproducing. Let's just do that for fun. Well, we'll call it a bit, right? Well, yeah, we'll say, hey, you got 50 points. No. Bro, how, how, how are they doing this? <laughs> that sounded pretty heavy. And they're going to really, this dude is going to whip it. <laughs> no, this dude, I don't like the look in this dude's eyes. <laughs> okay, Ash, that was weird timing. Okay, because he moaned with the sneeze when he got hit in the balls, okay? I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I don't like that that happened. Because I thought that he said, I thought he moaned, and that scared the hell out of me. Okay? That was very weird. Look at this man. Look at this man's wind up. This dude needs therapy. He doesn't need a hug. He needs therapy. Too much noise. No money. Too much noise. Mike went through all that for nothing. Bro, too much noise, my ass, bro. Are you kidding me? The team's total remains at fifteen hundred dollars. This man cannot have a child. That is such a big watch, by the way. Dude's wearing. No way, dude. No way. This episode is insane. Holly E from Jersey Shore. Chicken scratch. Couldn't even couldn't even tell you. Winter, how are you? Why are they always making everybody get shirtless on this show? What's up with that? I'm telling you, I'm one of the writers of this show. Okay, there are some fetishes going on there. You can't tell me otherwise. There are some fetishes. Okay? They're living out some weird, freaky dreams, and, and we know that that's true. The contestant must be scratched by rotating chicken feet. What? For 20 seconds. A chicken foot on a bl on a blender? The contestant must be scratched by... I mean, dude, if you gave me a thousand guesses, I would have never, ever in my life... They got... They got chicken little on that little blender. What? Rotating chicken feet. First of all, those nails look sharp. 20 seconds. Uh uh. That's. That's. Is that. This is going to be bad. Look at the. No. I mean, it's not the nipple. Are you kidding? Look at the dude, he's like... <laughs> I mean, maybe if you had some poison oak or something, it would feel good, but... Look at the marks all up... If anybody walks in and they, and, and they see you watching this right now, just tell them... Tell them something worse is on. Tell them you're on Pornhub, because... It's easier to say that than, than say, oh, just nowhere. It's just a guy getting his nipples scratched by a chicken foot on a blender. Nothing to see here. No worries, Dad. Just go ahead and go ahead and read the paper. Typical day here. First of all, that dude is now literally bleeding in some spots. I think that the producers of Saul decided it would be funny to make a TV show is what I think there. I think Jigsaw is riding around his bike behind stage there. These are the these are the things that didn't make it into the Saw movie. Your poise was admirable. The money is yours. 
Mike scratches out a win. Another $800 is added, oh. and the winnings rise to $2,300. If, if Andy is over, I should make him watch the sour cream bit real quick. How much money would it take you? Let me find it. Hold on here. How much money would it take you? Hi, say hi to the stream. There's Andy, everybody. Okay, I just fought right there. And I, I did not fart. That was me. How much money would it take you to do this? This guy walks in. Okay. This is Silent Library. Did, man, you just use some mouthwash? Yeah, bro. Wow. Uh, now, he has sour cream on his hair. And this man, without his friends laughing, has to suck all of the sour cream off of his hair. I want I want to know how much it would quite literally cost, so we could do it on stream if we do a dono goal. Okay, to get you to do this now starts kind of easy. Okay, we can go forward a little bit. Well, just to, just to already just to jump the gun a bit. I, I don't even eat sour cream. Okay, so this is going to be a real. Just to do a spoonful of sour cream, let alone on someone's hair, that's going to cost. Money is okay. Okay, now how about this right there? What are you thinking? What's the figure? Are we in the or are we in the thousand dollar range? I'm, I'm being realistic here. I'm not one of them, them guys that's like, oh, a million dollars. Like, I'm being realistic here. We're in, we're in 500. Okay, I think that's fair. Now let me show you one. Now how about how about that? No. <laughs> Now we're in the thousands. Shit. Let me show you one more. Okay, so a thousand for that. Now, how about if somebody? Holy shit! I feel sick. What if? Okay, look at this. Somebody attaches a chicken foot to a blender. Must be scratched by Okay, and you have to get your nipple scratched. How much for that one? What'd you say? Would you? Because because this one is more. Oh, not as bad. Okay. So maybe in the two hundred range. I'm just seeing what my budget should be here. On a drill, a blender drill. What do you? What are we thinking here? We might have unlocked a fetish here with Andy. <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> is he's getting a massage. All right, cool. I just wanted to know for the future if we do a stream. You would rather do that than the sour cream. Now, he's, now he does. He is bleeding a little bit and stuff. Yeah. I understand. Yeah. To just do one mohawk spike? Yeah. What if it was Jake Weber's hair? Uh, Jake Weber's hair... Would it go up or down in well, price? Wash it down with a monster energy. Well, that's so true. You have to bur energy. burn it. A thousand dollars? I'll be real... Uh, I'll do it 750. Okay. Yeah. 750, chat. Okay, we got a future stream planned here, chat. We'll figure that out if we can oh, raise the funds. Day. Surprise, 750 cash slammed on my desk, bro. Just, hey, you said it, not me. All right, thank you, Andy. Everyone clap for Andy, everybody. Thank you, Andy. Appreciate you, brother. All right, now we have it. <laughs> that's fine, good. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> All right, one day, chat, when we get rich here, we're going to come in. We're going to have Jake with sour cream on his hair, and we're going to say, remember what you said to us? Remember what you told us? And it's going to be in months down the line. He's going to go, no, no, mate, no, no, no. All right, let's lock in. And by lot, let's, I mean me. A little bit left in this episode, everybody. You guys have been very funny in the chat, by the way. I appreciate it. Hannah, how are you? Thanks for coming in. I've been, every time I look over, y'all are making funny ass jokes. So I appreciate you guys rocking with me here. This show is absolutely wild. Mark's going to get chosen. I can feel it. In this Max? challenge, five contestants must endure the punishment, and only one teammate Ooh, is Ooh, this safe. is a tough one. This is the group, the group stage, guys. What's it gonna be? Fizz drunk. Couldn't tell you. Let's find out. Okay, we have some. Dre oh man. First of all, beef water, not something I've ever wanted to read. Hot dog water, hot chili water, seaweed water, beef water, and Italian dressing. I'll tell you what, I think I could down some Italian dressing. Beef water? What is it? Well, the five contestants have 40 seconds to drink bottles of soda flavored with seaweed. 
Italian dressing, hot chili. Hot chili. Beef. Who got the beef? Whoever has the beef should get an extra thousand dollars or the hot dog water. Let's and hot dog water. Oh. Bro. There's literally. F All right. All right. How Chat. You know who failed this? Devante. He can't even chug regular water. We did the Sprite and, and banana challenge, and Devante was drinking like this for about two minutes, and then he put it back down, and there was like this much drink. It's like he drank like a little baby ladybug or some shit. Like I feel like if, if Devante had a drink off a chug contest with a ladybug and let's just say like four or five beetles, he would lose. Here we go. That is... Wow, they are committing. Good God! <laughs> the dude drinking the beef juice! How? What is this? This guy got a beef fetish. Look at him. He's tr What in the world is... How is this? What is he, a superhuman? Yeah, beef boy. Look at beef boy. I need a beef boy. I need a beef boy. Beef boy. Dude. <laughs> the hot chili is definitely not great. <coughs> Seaweed I could do probably. Okay, he just spit all Okay, he just spit all over everybody. Susan's obviously not thrilled. Nice. Slay baby, thank you so much. First of all, I missed Maya's resub. Let me say Maya, 26 months. That's very long. Thank you very much, Maya. <laughs> I appreciate you very much for that. And Slay Baby with the two gifted to 1900s, who is very active in this chat. So thank you. And Lexi as well. Thank you, Slay Baby. I don't blame him for this one. They're, they're, I mean, this is brutal. Beef Boy deserves an MVP, though. He must have did that before. Hey, he did the Triple H spray. If anybody knows the Triple H water spray, he just did it. What a burp that was. Good God a almighty. Effort. By some, you fail. The guys couldn't finish it. If I'm one of the teammates that drank the beef juice and the other dude couldn't finish his after the show, we're going to fight in the parking lot. Everything, so they win nothing. Their total stays put at $2,300. Imagine doing all that and getting zero. Final I mean, round. Come on. Worth more than the rest. $1,000. But do not forget. Last round, chat. Silence. Finish the game. It's on site. I agree. It'd be on site. Yeah. Oh my god, this show, being on this show would give me so much anxiety. Alright, it's Mark. It's actually Matt. I remember his name. This is Matt. I think. Too much babies. That's how JC says things. He's always, like, his, gr his grammatics are not great and said too many babies. But that's too much babies here. Like, if, if you had, like, the, a theater, at a movie theater, and you want to... That's too much babies. And I'll be like, JC, that, that's too many babies. Let's see what this is. Don't want to know. Don't want to find out, but... Oh boy. The contestant must receive the delivery of babies courtesy of the Octomom. Hold, hold on. Hold on. What? Now, hold on. Uh, wait a second. Wait just a second. Is this is this on MTV? What is is what what did I switch tabs? What's going? The contestant must receive the delivery of babies courtesy of the Octomom. Is that the actual Octomom? Why is she so excited? What Nadia Suleiman. It is her. Let's let before we let's just make sure this is legal. Oh. Chat, what is about to happen? This is like 2005 MTV. What is going on?
Yo, there's no way. There's no way. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Rocco. <laughs> What episode did I click on? Bro, we've watched a couple of these before. What? Okay, I'm not, not going to lie. That thing really shot out. That was kind of funny. What? And she does the push face. She's pushing all right. <laughs> my God. I have never in my life seen something like this. <laughs> oh. How did they get Octo Mom to do this? Oh. What the hell is this? <laughs> oh, this man is getting shot with babies out of a cannon. What in the hell is this? What the Never in my life have I seen something like this. Oh my goodness. What the hell is going on here today? What is going on here today, chat? That's, first of all, that is insane. Look at this one. Look at the rate it hits that man in the face. Bro, it broke his mask. Bro, she did that when she just exhaled. How are y'all timing the sneezes? I thought she sneezed. This sneeze is going to be the death of me, bro. This sneeze is the death of me. This man has his own TLC show with all those babies. Oh my god. Absolutely something I've never seen in my life. Never will again. Unbelievable. You delivered. And get the money. Vinny survived labor. Uh, so the guys win yeah, the real baby daddy challenge. Right there. They that end is... the day with a grand total of $3,300. These dudes deserve $33,000 for the shit that they endured. That is Congratulations, unbelievable. Congratulations, guys. You survived oh Silent God. Library. And you won some oh. cash. $550 per player. Ah, uh, dude. Not bad Absolutely for a day at the insane. library. $550 ain't bad back in 2005, but still, man. Good Lord Almighty. Chat. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. What else do you say about that? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> See, you can tell I don't pre-watch these things, because how the hell... How the hell could anybody know that that was coming?